<laughs> we're the Flash, and we're live from, from Comic Con. Yeah, yeah, we nailed it. Question cards. You have them. What? You have them. Oh, oh, yeah, I got it. Question cards. All right. So I'll be hosting today, so we're right. Okay, Grant Gustin. Here we go. That's me. That's me. That's me. Grant. Greg. Oh, you're Greg. Grant, are you ready? Yes. Okay. How was it playing the hero and the villain last season? This is a two-part question. That's the first part. Here's the second part. Which one did you enjoy more? <laughs> Am I ready? Okay, yeah, yeah, cool. Yeah. Um, it was fun. I got to, you know, great. It was so, great. All right. <laughs> no, 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 no. We, we, we do want to hear because that was no, very, very cool. It was fun to be Savitar. I got to do some different makeup and, you know, it was a whole different color for, for Barry and... It, it was a nice time, Tom. Yeah, no, I, but I, I, mean, I think And I think I honestly preferred playing the bad dude in last season. Right? It, was, it was just a different thing. Yeah, so, and yeah. you were, I think we can all agree, very, very, very good as the bad guy. Thank you. But seriously, did you, with the bad guy gone, were you kind of like, you know what, maybe I'd like to do that a little bit more? Or are you all right? Yeah, that could have been a longer arc. I would have yeah. been cool with that. We'll keep that in mind for seasons two. Well, no, come. I think we've passed it, so. <laughs> okay, can I move on? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Greg Gustin. Oh, no, wait. Okay, yeah. Carlos Valdez. Ah. This one. This one. Oh, hey. Carlos Valdez. Can you tease anything about Cisco's future with Gypsy? Uh, Gypsy, um, she's, he's in a... It's pronounced Gypsy. Oh, 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 my bad. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Carlos okay. Valdez. I already Can you tease anything about fine. Cisco's no, future we'll with Gypsy? So when I refer to her as Gypsy we'll in the scenes, it. we can reshoot it. Yeah, oh, we cool. can reshoot that. That's actually just ADR. Right. We don't have to shoot Endless it. Endless amounts of money. Meanwhile, right. back at the it's question. Amazing. So, um, the relationship with Gypsy, um... Yeah, sorry, go on. Do it, do it, do it. Ow. Sorry, go on. Go on. Jeez. Gypsy's relationship and Cisco. Yeah, so... Sexual... Remember, this is live. Sexual relationship. Inappropriate! What are you talking about? This, look, questions. we're grown people. This is 2017. Guys, these questions This is 2017. You're right, go, go, go. Sorry, okay, we got a lot so, to do. We got a lot to do here. Carlos, Cisco's relationship Carlos. with Gypsy... Um, is um, it's happening. I know I'm Carlos. Okay, all right. Okay, I get it. Play Cisco. I made the mistake. Just let me live with it. Yes, okay? yes, 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 yes. So Cisco's relationship with Gypsy. There are no mistakes. Would you? What? Say there are no mistakes. Go, 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 go. Okay, cool. So Cisco's relationship with Gypsy is gonna reach a new level next season. Oh, yes! I told you, right? A new level. Yeah, that's gonna be great. Third base. Uh. Video question for Keenan. Oh, fun. Oh, nice. Oh, so uh, then, we're gonna roll a we're gonna roll a video, and then Keenan, you're gonna ask answer the question right here. Please pay attention and All go. Right. Roll video. The question is: If you guys could cross over to a CW show, past or present, inside or outside of the Arrowverse, what would it be and why? 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 That's tough. <laughs> That's really tough. It's the multiverse, first off. But go ahead, ask. Um, what, what would be the the show that would make the least sense? Frost and Creek. Dawson's yeah, Creek. let's cross CW. over into Deep Sun CW. <laughs> <laughs> into Dawson's Creek. Um, I think would be really fitting, um, and it would make the most sense. So when the red lights on, camera's yeah, yeah, it's, it's over here. Camera. Oh, so I think we should do that. We should go to Dawson's Creek. Nice. <laughs> and thunder clouds coming down on San Diego. It looks like it's going to be a balmy night. Back yeah. to you, Jim. All right, Candace, Patton, Patton, Patton. Patton. That's actually doesn't say that. Guy. I'm just echoing. <laughs> what's one quality, because she has a billion, but what's one quality Iris has that inspires you? Mm, um, her courage. She's a lot of courage despite a lot of really difficult situations in her life. Um, I don't think I have as much as her. I'd love to have a little more. Uh, don't sell your shorts. You have a lot of courage. Thank you, Tom You're welcome. Kavanaugh. You're welcome. You know that's not the phrase. Please refer to me, by the way, as the wizard. Wizard, As wizard. I continue to host this thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Jesse L. Martin. Yes. Favorite metahuman so far? Um, well, that's tough. That's a tough one. Who are you looking at? Are we allowed to say uh, the, the villain of uh, episode one? Todd Helbing? Todd? Todd? Todd Helbing? Todd? It's Producer Todd. of the show, The Flash. Phone a friend. Phone a friend. Are we allowed to say the villain in episode one? Episode one? No. Oh, oh, great. Oh, Buzz Joy. Okay, That's so, who let's go. it is. Don't so my ready. favorite meta is somebody you haven't met yet. Who's your Ooh. second favorite? <laughs> second favorite? Yeah. What's in his avatar? 
Oh. Oh. oh, yeah, you did. That's so good. What a great answer. Video question for Tom. Do we need to do that? I think people yes, are sick it. of me already. Do it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. Video question for Tom. I look- My question is, are we going to get another Harrison Wells for season four? Another one kind of similar to H.R. Wells because he was, I think, the coolest Wells we ever had. Yeah. Dad, thanks for that question. Um... I can't believe your dad called in. We ran the numbers. Yeah, my dad, well, that's the only person going to ask a question, me. <laughs> we ran the numbers, and what we found was there's, uh, the, the, the less I'm on the show, the more successful the show is. Which, I don't know, that's been explained in different ways by different agents and WB and the CW to me, but it turns out that, yes, we will have more Wells. Z- 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 Danielle. Yes, sir. Hannah Baker. That's me. Oh, Hello. yes. You're amazing. I think you're you do a great job Thanks. on the show. You too, Tom. Quick question. Yep. Which do you enjoy playing more, Caitlin Snow or Killer Frost? I like that I get to do both. I like that I get to have fun and be the villain sometimes, but I also get to be Caitlin Snow in Star Labs hanging out with Team Flash. I'm not looking for a damn politically correct answer. <laughs> All right? The question is, do you enjoy playing more Caitlyn Snow or Killer Frost? You like them both? Asked and answered. Okay, you're right. You're you're right. Video question for Grant (laughs) Gustin, which we've established is this gentleman right here. Just please watch the video. Please watch the video. Video question for Grant. (laughs) The question for you is if you woke up one day with super speed, what is the first thing that you would do? Solid question. Excuse me. Um, I, I've always said, it's kind of always stayed my answer over the last few years, that I, I would still just make the show in Vancouver and then go home to California as soon as I wrapped, sleep there, visit my family in Virginia, go back to Vancouver, keep working on the show. Uh. I like that. Yeah, I like that. And if we were like, didn't have super speed and we were all on set, could be like, could you get us some pizza? Would you be down for that? Yeah. Chicken wings. That's the kind of team player he Chicken is. Chicken wings, pizza, yeah, whatever you all want. If I had super speed, it'd be like... Boom, done. And it's free game, yeah. Yeah. I like yeah, that. I love you guys. I took over because the next question is for this guy, Tom yeah. Cavanaugh. Will you be directing more episodes for season four? Yes. Rock on. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Jesse L. Martin, yes. this is great. <laughs> this is amazing. What are you most excited about for Joe and his new relationship with Setchley? <laughs> yes, Setchley. What? Does that mean? Cecile? Cecile? Oh, Cecile. Cecile. What are you most excited about? <laughs> what are you most excited about for Joe and his new relationship with Cecile? I'm excited to see how serious we get. Was that a joke? Did you hear what he said? It's sexual again. He's excited to see how serious we get. I am too. Yeah. You guys, back to, by the way, and we worked on it together uh, when I was directing. You guys are like phenomenal on screen together. Phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal on screen together. And it's great. Personally, I think it's great that there's going to be more of that this season. Video question. I mean that. I really do. Video question for Candace. Candace, have you gotten to do any work at CCPN, or do you think Iris is going to get to be there more this year? We'd all love to see Iris investigating metas and bringing them to the team. Thank you. Thank you. I'm staring down our producer. Um, I don't think that's going to happen this season. Sorry, guys. Um, Iris is taking on a more team leader position at Star Labs. It doesn't mean she's not a reporter. It doesn't mean we'll never see that. But I wouldn't hold out too much hope for um, ace reporter Iris West season four. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. Help me, Tom. Carlos <laughs> Valdez. Valdez. No, I was letting that sit there because it was a real awkward moment. It's and so, like, awkward. we have, like, peaks and valleys dramatically. So <laughs> that was a valley. I did. I let yeah. it sit there. Like, lead. Carlos Valdez. Valdez. Why do you have two last names the same? That's weird, right? That's it is weird. Oh, wait, there's an, oh, wait, there's an, a little asterisk, and it says, Will Chisco get a suit upgrade? Will Chisco get a suit upgrade? Um, I don't... Uh, see that happening uh, anytime soon. I think the suit that we currently have is uh, is dope. pretty dope. dope. Yes, yeah, that's that's a good word for it. My shoes. my ass feels great in the leather. It's We're all a little bit jealous great, of your yeah. shoes, by the way. They don't get featured that Thank much on camera. Thank you so but much. They're um. I got them. Uh, all, 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 all. Oh, it's about my own petard. Um, Danielle Panabaker, uh, what's one characteristic you like about Killer Frost? Oh, they're trying to pin Ooh, you down. Ooh. Um. I like how determined she is. Once she gets up, gets gets excited about something, she's committed and she's not gonna give up. Yep. Yep. I also like how the frost comes off her body. Yeah, that's so cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Keenan Lonsdale, 
Favorite memory with a fan at Comic-Con? Oh, this is great. Oh, it was just yesterday, actually. I ran into a fan that I, in, like, I invited some fans to be in a video that I was making, and she was um, there when I walked out, and so I gave her a big hug yesterday, and it was really awesome to have that moment. That's awesome. Yeah, that, that is tremendous. It does, does it? Up, <laughs> Sorry, right here. Grant Gustin. How was it playing the hero and the villain last season? We already did. Which is, I know we answer. did. I know, guys. I did Ladies that on purpose. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching <laughs> you. The Flash Season 4 premieres Tuesday, October 10th at 8, 7 central on The CW. <laughs>